welcome to GTR1 News. Today our top story is about how media and technology affect today's youth. Now on to the field with Jane filming Carlos. Thank you, Angela, and I'm here with Carlos. So, Carlos. Hi. Do you think that media and technology have affected today's youth in a negative and positive way? I don't know. Oh. Do you think video games are affecting schooling? No, I, I got solid D's. I'm good. Do you think that there's too much technology in your guys' world? No. That was interesting. We'll check in the field with Brent now. See how he's doing with uh, Rwanda, I guess. Thanks, Dexter and Angela. I'm sitting here with Rwanda right now. And I would like to know how you feel about media and technology. It's bad. It's bad. Now, why would you say that? Just, it's just bad. Yeah. All right. So, how does technology influence you? Oh. <laughs> okay. Do you watch lots of TV? I see you're using a phone. Yeah. 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 So clearly you are influenced by media. I like my phone. She likes her phone. There you have it. Back to you. Okay. Thanks, Brent. That was really interesting. Now we're going to skip to another male reporter, and he's going to interview Lance and see what his opinions are on this. Thank you, Angela and Dexter. Now here we are with Lance. Hello, Lance. Hello. Now... How would you say technology and media affect today's youth? Um, it affects today's youth because they lose their identity by having too much technology. Like, um, their culture can be lost because um, the technology brings them away from their home and then they can lose their language because um, computer websites aren't made in their language. Very good. Now would you say that technology and media have positively or negatively affected today's youth? It depends on the youth. If they use too much technology, it can be a negative effect because they lose social abilities. But if they use too little technology, it and they don't get outside their bubble. And they don't get outside their bubble. Like Carlos. Like Carlos. Who stays at home and plays video games all day. Very good. Well, Looks like that's all the time we have with you. Thank you very much. And there you have it. Groundbreaking news. Right here, you heard it first at GTR1 News. See you next time. <laughs>